is a place where you get to help people do what's meaningful to them. Our program exposes students to all the different types of practice settings that we can work in. And so uh, we work with individuals in uh, developmental centers, in schools, in special education. Uh, we work with individuals in mental health treatment facilities and in nursing homes. We work with individuals in hospitals, community-based practice settings, and so the profession is very broad. The reason we have community partnerships with Ready for Life and with Matthews House is because Ready for Life, Matthews House, and Simu Case are all modules in what we call our level one fieldwork placement. So when our students are working with the clients at Ready for Life, they have an opportunity to be a therapist. They, they are in charge of working one-on-one -on -one with one of those clients from Ready for Life and helping that person solve a real-life problem. We had students that worked with crew at Matthews House to develop resources so that they understood all the places in and around Grand Rapids where you could get your clothes washed, where you could take a shower, or where you could find a meal. We have graduates that go to work in special education in regular K-12 schools. We have graduates that go to work in hospitals and nursing homes, uh, rehab hospitals, uh, long-term care facilities and skilled nursing facilities, mental health treatment facilities, and, and a variety of other community-based practice settings. We help our students understand what it means to work with a diverse population, what meaningful activities look like from different cultures and different races and different belief systems. And we help our students respect other people and other people's lifestyle. One area specifically that we use in our level one fieldwork experiences, along with our students working with the populations at Ready for Life and at Matthews House, is something called SimuCase. This is a state-of-the-art simulation platform that allows the students to have experiences with older patients in home care. That's been especially helpful since the COVID-19 pandemic, and we're not able to actually move into people's homes and work with people in their homes, and it allows the students to have that experience. Our graduates and the employers of our graduates have consistently uh, praised our program for our ability to, to turn out quality graduates that are ready to go to work and are really competent and are becoming leaders within the profession. The focus is always the same. What are those everyday life skills someone needs to be able to do and how can we help that to happen?